Well, Texoma back the batch teed off today for its annual Wheeler and Castellano Memorial Golf Tournament. News 12's Erin Pillay tells us how the fundraiser is helping law enforcement families. Nearly 150 players grabbed their clubs and hit the links for the 8th annual Back the Badge Golf Tournament. The fundraiser was created by Katie Country Morning Show host Zach Grantham and Grayson County Sheriff Captain Ricky Wheeler. He and I wanted to do something for several years. We just didn't know what it was. It turned out Ricky loved to play golf. So the tournament was born. But after the first year, Wheeler passed away from cancer. I was very grateful when they decided to um, come and ask me if they could use his name to be a part of it. Also remembered is former Sherman police officer Vincent Castellanos, who died after a long battle with cancer at just age 36. With the new name, the tournament has grown. Proceeds from the tournament help the nonprofit donate to families of law enforcement officers who have been injured, diagnosed with a deadly disease, or even killed in the line of duty. We immediately write them a $10,000 check to give to the family just to say, hey, we appreciate you. We're sorry you're having to go through this. Jared Taylor's family family is one of many who have benefited from the foundation. Just the support from them has been amazing. A Bryan County Sheriff's deputy, Taylor was killed in the line of duty in a car wreck in 2020. You go through the unimaginable. People might think that they can understand or imagine what it would be like. But I don't really think you can unless you've been there. This year, half a million dollars has been raised for Back the Badge, all to help law enforcement officers who dedicated their lives to protect and serve. In Sherman, Aaron Pillay, News 12.